everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Crystal with me, your host, John Garcia. First, oh yeah, blah, blah, blah. Um, so since last time I didn't really do anything, I went back and got some berries, but this is Gym Guy! Hey, Gym Guy's back! Believe me, if you believe, a championship dream can come true, you believe? Then listen, the grass type is weak against the flying type. That's why you don't pick a Chikorita in this game. Trust me, it's not worth it, and I just realized my mouse was on screen, sorry about that. Let's see, um, for some reason, this flying type gym is shaped like a dollar sign. Um, I don't know if that was intentional? Maybe it's supposed to, I don't, I, I can't think of anything else it's shaped like. I mean, it's an S with the, some lines in between, and that's pretty dollar signy to me. Um, <clears throat> Uh, let's test out our new Ember attack, which uses our better special stat and uses uh, and is more powerful. And wow, wow! Well, that was a critical, so that doesn't count. But still, wow! Look at that damage, Raymond. You are defeating Abe, which is such an old person name. I mean, it's a patriarchal name, not like in the bad kind of patriarchy where it's like, hey, look, women aren't as good, but the kind of patriarchy that's like, hey, look. Let's, uh, let's, uh, start religions in the Middle East, and then they can start other religions, and let's, uh, let's start, like, three gigantic religions that are, like, the main focus. Sorry if my voice is going out, I'm trying to, uh, adjust myself properly. Okay, here's the thing. I bet we can beat both these trainers without taking damage, and then I won't have to take a trip back to the Pokemon Center. I was wrong... Well, maybe I'll just use a potion. Here's if if they do so little damage, Ember's got enough PP. I, I'm just I, mean, I might just use a potion. Um, but yeah, uh, as you can see, <laughs> this gym is a cakewalk if you power leveled like me um, and have way over level Pokemon. If you have a Chikorita, you have to level up this much because um, everything is going to kill you otherwise. Um, one addition to this game is Gust has been changed from a... Uh, obviously, the pig, Pidgeys now have Tackle, but Gust has now been changed from a, uh, a normal-type attack to a flying-type attack, which means that it will destroy your Chikorita, or your Caterpie, or your Ladybug, or your Spinarak, or whatever, um, and, and it, will never, it will never show mercy to you in your pitiful life. Um... But that's 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 what's not not what's important right now. Look at this, we got nine berries because I because I've uh because um usually I wouldn't have this many berries, but you know, every episode I'm I'm going I'm going back getting berries because I'm you know going slow pace for the purpose of the AOP. Uh, but look at this. This uh this here's the thing, Raymond might be able to take on the whole gym. Buffy's gonna help, Sama's gonna sit in the back and cheer us on. That's what Sama's for. I really like Faulkner's hair. That's the gym leader, by the way, Faulkner. Let's beat him up. Yeah, I'm Faulkner, the violent Pokemon gym leader. People say you can clip flying-type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity, or some scissors, I don't know, forceps, whatever. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. Um, it's not slander to say that flying-type Pokemon have resistances. Pretty much... Or have weaknesses. All Pokemon have weaknesses. Except for, like, Sableye, but that's not even in this game yet. Uh, but yeah. Basically, you know how Pidgey is, like, one of the worst flying types ever? That's what this person uses. The first gym is a joke, unless you have, uh, Chikorita. Um, well, it can be a little hard. I mean, you might need a lot. I mean, you're gonna want to level a bunch. The, the real problem is Mud Slap. That is the, uh, special ability that all these guys have. Which, it's really weird because it's a ground-type attack on um, flying-type Pokemon. What? And it lowers your accuracy, which is a butt to handle. I almost word-batted, but I don't word-bad in Vitero. That's why I'm gonna... I'm just gonna switch to, uh... Now, now they've got uh, Pidgeotto. And the thing is, Pidgeotto... Okay, Pidgey evolves at level, um... Level 16. This Pidgeotto... Um, which has a cool animation. I can't, I can't help but say Pidgeotto looks cool. It's just a crappy Pokemon. Is level 9. I'm not complaining that I'm not facing a level 16 in the first gym, but why is it only level 9? Uh, I don't know. Um, there is a very, very circu circu circuitous blah, 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 way to get a Pidgeotto at level 9, 
but I, I can't see a guy sitting here at Violet City Gym doing that. Um, what, what my strategy right now is, I'm trying to, um, I'm trying to confuse it, because that, with, I mean, you, you see, it's doing some decent damage. Um, if, if this Pidgeotto used a bunch of Mud Slaps against my, uh, against my Cyndaquil, it could potentially hurt me. I'm gonna use a potion. Can't believe the first gym leader is making me use the potion. I bought some potions off screen. That's what I did. That's that's what I forgot to tell you guys that I did. Um, and now I'm just gonna use Gust again. Come on, come on. Um, but basically, we're gonna confuse it and then we're gonna ember it to death. Might throw in some smoke screens in case like it comes to, but I really don't think it's gonna be a problem. Come on, Supersonic! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, Buffy, you're so useless right now. You're as weak as uh, Cordelia. Yeah, she didn't do anything. Cordelia. I can't believe our Buffy is dying to a freaking. If if you make me use Sama, so help me God. Okay, let's smoke screen this Pidgeotto, make it less likely to uh, actually hit us with Mud Slap, because that will be. Stupid, because it would lower our accuracy. Why aren't you using Mud Slap? Mud Slap would be better, wouldn't it? Let me see. Mud Slap has, I think, a base 20 power, so that would do 40 against us. Gust has a base 40 power, so yeah, with with uh, same type of attack bonus, uh, it would it, it's more powerful. But still, you could be lowering our accuracy right now, Pidgeotto. That's what's important: lowering our accuracy on our most powerful Pokemon. Why aren't you doing that? I am upset at this Pidgeotto for not using the best strategy. Um, but whatever. Bad game AI. Maybe he might use a... He might use a potion. Nope. Why is Tackle missing? Tackle's just as accurate as Ember, I think. I don't know. I can't check because this game doesn't have accuracy. Lizard. Whatever. Let's just use Ember. Yes! Catch that bird on fire. We are the heroes of this story, you guys. And we are catching birds on fire. Raymond grew to level 14. Yeah, Raymond is, um... Raymond is really over leveled right now, um, but don't worry, we'll uh, we'll 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 put him on the back burner for a while. And we got the Zephyr badge. Not only okay, cool gym. Oh my God, really? Already? <laughs> Raymond's already evolving. I forgot he evolved that quickly. Do into whoa! Look at the shiny the dipping dots that fly out of his face. Congratulations, your Raymond evolved into a Quillava. He's a longer ferret with a mohawk. Here's the thing. Faulkner looks really cool. His gym looks really cool. The Zephyr Badge is such a cool name. But this gym disappoints because it's just a bunch of Pidgeys. Who cares? It's Pidgeys. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. Okay, I mean, I'll admit that that Pidgey did a decent amount of damage to Syndical, but Syndical, but, uh, Raymond didn't do anything, like, to... To hurt it or anything, I don't know. It's a little bit better. okay. Mud slap we got. Um, maybe we'll teach that to something, but not right now. For now, let's just head out this gym because that was that was way too easy. We'll we'll fight harder gym someday. What? A scripted phone call? Hello, Urg. We've discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? Yeah, click. Yeah, I'm gonna say click instead of hanging up the phone. It's a kind of new thing we're trying out. Okay, I'll see you later. Oh wait, I'm not on the phone with you anymore. Uh, let's see, there is the assistant. You can tell he's a scientist because he wears glasses. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Would you take a Pokemon egg? Yeah, I'll take the Pokemon egg. Hurig received egg. You have to say it like that. Egg. A Pokemon will not hatch until it grows in the egg. It also has to be with other active Pokemon to catch. Hell yeah, you are the only person we can rely on. Please go race around when that egg hatches. Okay, you're weird. Um, I haven't really talked to anyone in Violet City. I was planning to give them British accents because they're so near to Scotland or Ireland or whatever it's called. But whatever. Who cares because nobody here says anything interesting. Violet City is awesome because it has awesome theme music. It has two really easy... Uh, like challenges, the Sprout Tower and the uh, and the gym, but I mean, who? It's a disappointment. You'll find that with a lot of gym, a lot of towns in this game. They're really cool, but they don't really have much to them. Um, it's this game was really limited by uh, 
the the amount of uh, data they could fit on a on a thing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A thing, you know, none of those things. Um, but yeah, let's um let's look at our egg. Let's ha catch our next Pokemon, and then let's uh let's end the episode. Um, because why would we? Oh, hey, let's talk to this guy. Hey, you're not stopping us now, huh? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. It increases the power of grass type. Yeah, we really need that with all the grass type Pokemon we have. Uh, I guess if you have a Chikorita, first of all, why? Second of all, give it give it that to up the power. It's probably already rolling Razor Leaf, the most powerful rat grass type attack in the game. I... I'm sorry, grass really annoys me because I like the type, but it's it's been so wasted in the Pokemon games until until maybe like generation three, maybe even four. Like there aren't very many good grass type Pokemon. Um not a lot of good ways to use grass Pokemon. Um uh, let's go over here. Um I'm gonna avoid the trainers for now because I wanna fight them when we actually get our next Pokemon. Is this it? No, this is not it. We're not catching another... Well, we might catch another Bell Sprout just for... You know, let's let's catch it just for nostalgia's sake. Remember Smitty, you guys? Remember Smitty from last... From the blue? You probably don't, because no one watched Pokemon Blue. And no one's watching this either. Except, like, Brandon. Maybe Hootig. I don't know. Hootig's probably left already. It's okay. I... <laughs> I do these because they're fun for me, not because people watch them. Like, I, 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 I enjoy doing Let's Plays a lot. Um, uh, I don't know why I do, but I do. Um, let's catch this Bellsprout. We will name it after Smitty. Wait, oh, it's a girl Bellsprout. Oh, wait, was Smitty a boy or... I don't remember if Smitty was a boy or a girl. I don't remember Smitty ever having a gender identity. We could name it after Smitty. Or we, we can name it Smitat. <laughs> Smit, Smitantha. Smit, Smitina. Smitina? That's weird. Whatever, we got a bell sprout. Also, I uh, bought some more Pokeballs off screen. I forgot to say that. Um, but yeah, we caught this bell sprout. Um, look at its its footprint. That's kind of cool. It's like a little, little root. All root there. Yeah, let's name it Smitty Jr. Smitty Jr. Ah, uh, for someone who's like, I'm catching all these Pokemon that I don't really want on my team, which is just taking up unnecessary time. But whatever. Um, so I'm gonna have to box some of these soon, probably. Um, basically, what I'm trying to do is have one new Pokemon for every uh, gym leader, and then like th that's actually on the team, like. Obviously, I would have started out with Raymond, and then I put Buffy on the team, and now, because we just beat a gym, I'm gonna get this next Pokemon on my team, if I can frickin' find it in the frickin' grass. Let's see, it might be here, who, who, who knows? No, oh, wow, there are Ekans in this game? I didn't know you could find wild Ekans here, wow, well, I haven't played Crystal in a while, that must be why. I'm just not gonna bother with it, you guys know, kind of Ekans. I might use an Ekans in 3rd gen. Because I had a good experience using an Ekans when I played my Fire Red um, back in the day. But why are there so many snakes? There's a snake in my boots! That was a terrible impression. Why are there so many terrible impressions? There's a terrible impression in my boots! Okay, let's see. Let's uh, get a Great Ball. That's right. We put the Great Ball in the Great Ball pocket of balls and balls. Let's make ball jokes, make ball jokes. Hey, look, is it the Pokemon we're going to catch already? God dang it, no, why are there so many Ekans? <sighs> I might, if this goes on for too long, I might just cut it until I find that Pokemon, because this is annoying me. Do No, why? Why, Ekans? Do you want to just be on our party? Do you want me to just catch you, Ekans? Because I can catch you. I could, if I wanted to. Well, here's that dang Ekans again, and I looked it up, and I found out that this Pokemon that I want on my party, um, which is Mareep, uh, which I was gonna name after Tressa, but now I guess not. Oops, I accidentally killed the Ekans. I don't even care. Um, it's not in this, uh, it's not in this game. Mareep is not in this game, so, um, 
Looks like I have to make some adjustments to what I want in my final party. Um, so that's kind of annoying me. But anyway, I guess I'll see you guys later. Tell me if you have any suggestions for my party to replace my reap or anything. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I've got like a tentative party in my mind, but you know, there's always changes available. Um, and I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Pokemon Crystal! <laughs>